Okay, so this is my Ultrafire WF502B 50 milliwatt green laser by Dino Direct. Um, it is quite small. It's not a very large host, but it feels quite solid and it's actually pretty good quality. Um, the clip itself is hard, tensioned, and that's strapped on there pretty good. There's um, two little screws that you can undo to take it off if you don't want it. Um, it has been quality controlled, but it sure doesn't look like it. If we just give this a little jiggle, we can hear a very distinct um, sound coming from it. If I take off the tail cap, we see there's an o-ring around the back of the thread this prevents leaks from water or moisture which is a good good um, good aspect um, so if we shake this tail cut not sure if that got picked up on the camera we can hear a definite shake now if I hold the spring and do the same thing it's still there, so it's not the spring. It must be the clicky bit, the switch on the inside of this. So I will probably have to change that out or fix it up, repair it. So if I take off this front piece, we get to the laser module on the inside. Now the laser module is somewhat press fit into the heat sink <clears throat> at the bottom but I can still wobble it around it is really poorly built uh, the heat sink itself is not that large and looks like it's an off cut from a piece of metal um, but if we take it and we shake this part we can still hear a rattle. I was looking around, looking on the inside, looking for something that's rattling, but I finally figured it out. It was the lens part of the module resting on the crystal set of the of the of the laser. It looks like that they've unscrewed the lens part all the way down into the module itself and it's just sitting there on top of the crystals which is probably not a good sign so that's our physical um, I guess review of the laser I'll try and get those two problems fixed up and then I'll try and get a review of of the performance thank you